guys, welcome to Cosmic Hamsters. As you may be able to tell in the background here, getting ready for a new hamster. Um, haven't got one, <laughs> don't know who I'm going to get, but I'm getting ready. Um, I'm trying to make some platforms, which is why this clank of wood is here. And this, but in the meantime, I've been spending. So yeah, let's do a little unboxing. This one, first of all, is from um, Too Good To Chew. Oh, hey! Too Good To Chew. Let's have a look. Ooh. Oh, that's cute. Ooh. Yeah. Halloween coming up. Yeah, there for Halloween. Woo That's so cute. Right, on to the big one. Hope's healthy treats. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, ooh, exciting. Right, let's see what we have got. Oops. <laughs> oh wow, I really should measure things. <laughs> Grass mat, a big tunnel. Um, oh, I've some of this for ages, bamboo root. Oh look, it's like it's got nostrils. <laughs> A little one, I think that's going to go in Comet's page. And a big one, it's going to go in there. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is fabulous. Ooh. Got some new balls. Trio of fun balls. Uh. Oh, too heavy for me to lift. <laughs> Got some natural sand. I'm gonna leave that in there and then ooh, see this peeking through already. Stocked up on flax seeds because not flax seeds, flax sprays. Comet's favourite. And then oh, got some monkey nuts. Ooh, excited about this, some beach chips. I'm going to set up some different substrate in this cage. Some coconut chips. My thinking with this is I've got some glass, um, like cookie jar things that Moonbeam used to have, like sand bathing. I've got a couple of those, so I'm thinking set up these different substrates. So, ooh, I like this. Yeah. Oh, coconut chips. And then put some treats in and we can pour them out. But we'll see. That's the plan, whether it'll work, I don't know. And then some seaside forage. Um, what's in this one? Contains marigold, blue cornflowers, dandelion, and chamomile flowers. We're going to try some of that in Comet's Cave. I've got these little terracotta dishes coming, so I'm going to set them up. And if any of you know, I had weevils last year. Oh, hang on, let's show this. Leaf forage, so I'm opening this. Yeah, I got weevils in the hamster cages last year when it was really hot, like a lot of people did, and it took me forever to get rid of them. And they came in from the forage, even though I was pretty adamant that I'd frozen them. So I definitely freeze all of this stuff for a, a week, 
minimum. <laughs> um, so I'm trying to get over my PTSD caused by that because just me, it was horrible. Um, so I thought I'd try some foragey stuff on some terracotta dishes. So yeah, little leaf thing. And this has got parsley, basil, raspberry, dandelion, nettle and dill. Cool. Wow. Love them all. Thank you very much. Hope's healthy treats. Highly recommend her. And too good to chew.